This bad boy mega music star has been shot nine times and survived. And now he's on a life-saving mission in one of the most dangerous places on Earth. Tonight, 50 Cent as you've never seen him before. I've never seen anything like this before. See the whole picture on Nightline tonight on ABC. And hello to our Facebook fans. I'm Rob Nelson with the top stories on this Thursday. Former University of Virginia lacrosse player George Hughley has been sentenced to 26 years in prison for the murder of his ex-girlfriend Yardley Love. Jurors rejected prosecutors call though for a sentence of life in prison. The Republican presidential candidates head back out on the campaign trail today, fresh from last night's face-to-face -face clash in Arizona. It may have been their final debate. It was their 20th. There are critical primaries next Tuesday in both Arizona and Michigan. The cops in Deer Park, Texas, had a problem, one of their own stealing food and drinks from the office fridge. They set up a surveillance camera and waited for Officer Kevin Yang to dig in. After three weeks, Yang was hauled in for questioning. He said he was taking it upon himself to simply clean the fridge. That didn't fly. He was busted, and now Yang is serving a 30-day unpaid suspension and faces misdemeanor theft charges. And she plays a doctor on TV. Now Kate Walsh is putting her own anatomy on display, posing nude on the cover of the latest issue of Shape magazine. The 44-year-old private practice star says she feels healthy, confident, and sexy. Walsh says she is enjoying her 40s, and she adds that she has no plans on getting plastic surgery anytime soon. All right there. Get more news anytime at abcnews.com. Thanks for watching. I'm Rob Nelson. This is World News Now, available anytime, anywhere you want it. Friday, Barbara Walters takes you inside plastic surgery as you've never seen. More on the edge, more outrageous than ever. Why did you want this? Friday, Barbara Walters, The Cutting Edge. Friday at 10, 9 central, after What Would You Do on ABC. Investigation that changed lives. So powerful, it even changed laws. ABC News 2020 and Brian Ross, winner of the prestigious George Polk Award. ABC News, watch and see the whole picture.